Lisa Ray. Good, I'm good. Congratulations on your new show. Thank I know you. I heard I heard it open with the number one rating in TV One history. I know, right? When I heard that the next day, I was like, wow. And then I was the the trendy topic on Twitter. Like, wow. Okay. We got you live right now. You're on Twitter right now. So hey, my Twitter fam, the real L Ray. Logging in, y'all logging in. <laughs> so uh, you got your beautiful daughter here with you. I do, I PR for the for the movie and for well for my movie that I just booked <laughs> and for the reality show so I'm just you know I'm, I'm back and I'm feeling good and I'm glad that I'm able to do both and just come back with just a, a, a blast and a bang so that's a good thing. I think I heard something about the movie. Is it with Queen Latifah or something? You're doing your homework. Yeah, it's uh, Queen Latifah Queen Latifah production. So it's a VH1 movie and it's going to be filmed in Atlanta. I start in about two weeks. I must feel good to go through your whole journey, I know, right? and where you took a break from acting, come back, and now you got to hit TV show and a movie it's so coming. So relevant, it, it feels really good because I, at first when I came back, I was thinking I can't take a movie right now, I can't concentrate, you know. But then that's why I decided to do the reality show. And then in the midst of the big commercial of a reality show is being over, then the movie comes, and it's like that's the way it's supposed to happen. Bam, bam, bam. Now, why do you think? I mean, I'm sure because you got your star power. Why do you think your show is such a hit? Do you think it's because women can identify their I lives with you? Everybody's want to be in my business. No, no. I think that's what it is. <laughs> I think that's what it is. I think from coming off the scandal of the divorce with all the rumors and the gossip and not really knowing the story and not really knowing how to support me or to hate me, um, there's a message that could be missed there, and it is that no woman wants to go through that. Everybody's looking for love, and when you can't find that and you thought you found it and in your world comes crashing down like your fairy tale turns into a nightmare, you have to find some type of strength in that and say, you know what, I she's identifiable because I can relate to that because I've gone through that or I don't want to go through that. And that's the message that it is besides just coming back and from celebrity, first lady, first lady to celebrity, you know. And the, the talk on the chat, the chatter is all about the closeness of you and your relationship with your daughter. Now, now a lot of people, you know, don't, under, don't understand the relationship. Could you just tell, like, I mean, y'all growing up, like, how, why are y'all so... <laughs> I've been, getting, I've been getting hits a lot about, you know, a mother saying, oh, I love the relationship between you two, and then I'm getting hits by haters that say, oh, that's not right, or, you know, and it's like, what do you mean it's not right? A mother can never overlove their child, so, everybody, well, everybody I, 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 I can't overlove my child. This is my only child. This is my, my best friend. You know, I'm responsible for her life, and I'm proud of her, and that's all that right there is mine. That's one thing for sure. She came out of me. <laughs> so that's that's love. Nothing but love, baby. Well, thank you for taking the time. We're going to keep on tuning in every Thursday night. And we can't wait till your movie come out. That's right. Thank you very much.